Yeah, yeah, man. Welcome back to the channel. Tom Yes. We in here, man. Shout out to the whole family, man. Yeah, we about to look at my boy T.I. <laughs> he, he responds to um, Boosie. If y'all ever, if y'all was keeping up what was going on, you know, basically, he, um, you know, Boosie was just saying he not fucking with T.I. no more. You know, whenever that little shit resurfaced, when him talking about he told on his dead cousin and all that, but we're going to let them explain it and stuff. <laughs> it's just funny shit. Dumb shit. <laughs> What's going on, world? It's your dumb shit. What's going on, world? It's your me since they ripping them back again with another video. Today we got T.I. finally that, that like and Boosie the subscribe button, calling him yeah. out on Vlad TV yesterday. That's right, y'all. For those who missed it, Boosie finally addressed the viral video of T.I. admitting to snitching on his deceased cousin, and we finally got T.I. responding. Before we get into what T.I. had to say, mm -hmm. let's check out this it. clip so you can get um. context to what's going on, <laughs> and I will catch you afterwards with T.I.'s response and my commentary. All right, with that being said, let's get right to it. Pull us over. Pull us over. I have a gun. Why are we going through the court pressing? And so we caught no gun case to mm -hmm. that. And, you know, my lawyer said, well, you know, I can make everything go away if it, if it was if it was, too, if it was Tramiel's. So after he had passed, I had a talk with him. What to say? To say, I take all the charges you got. Mm. If you can walk away free and put it on me, goddamn right. So is that so, what boys giving you shit about because you put it on? No, nah, hell no. Nah, okay. Nah, nah. Don't nobody even know about that. I just volunteered. This <laughs> <time>. <laughs> Don't nobody even know about that. I'm just being honest. Yeah. That's the only time mm. that you. I done never said or gave no information about nobody. Because that's my cousin, my big cousin. Mm. He was dead. And he told me that it was okay. <laughs> What the fuck okay, he so told you is out. okay. No. Like, get the fuck oh. out of here, man. Like, so you have a finished album with T.I. that's not coming out? No, because it ruined everything. Because of that. It ruined everything. I woke up with my fucking phone, everything full. Like, Boosie, you cannot do an album, Boosie. My real fans, like, Boosie, you the last one left. Now, moments ago, T.I. responded to Boosie with a post that reads, Yeah, so I don't know if it's you or your OG uncle that needs to see it, but I got my paperwork ready to show. Pull up. My number's the same. And my my paperwork. The same. <laughs> to get on the net and speak what on what you, you never spoke to me about is leaving me to believe you've you been straight up your said that this that's time. what you did. So I never what speak certain you got disrespect on your name slash reputation about it if, homie. The convict code says when in doubt, pull the paperwork out. And if you ain't did that, Keep your mouth shut. Now, I don't know what type of time you're on, but I say again, if it was a question or confusion about anything I said, you could have called and asked. So you could report back and tell your OG, or you could have pulled up and checked the black and white like I'm offering now. Either way, I'm not bound to anyone's opinion of me, because what they think will never outrule what I know. So don't wonder no more, homie. Answer the if. Pull up and report back to the rest of the homies whose opinions matter so much to you. Because I could give a F about what any person thinks about me. The tail shall never wag the dog. Leadership leads with facts and stats. We don't follow no fantasy land-ish. Remember that. And I ain't bending my knees for nothing or fearing nothing but God. So come on and see what you're speaking about so next time you can speak intelligently. Boosie, I expected more from you. This ish ain't silent. Obviously, I thought we were something... We wasn't. Look at this long wow. ass now again, fucking that was T. I was story. Boosie like, nigga, he sound like a bitch. TV after Boosie sound was like asked his hole. opinion on this viral video of T.I. admitting to snitching on his deceased cousin. That's what I'm saying. You, you, you all camera. Boosie, <laughs> he decided got to get away from the collab out me had Come planned on, with T.I. Even went as far as to call him T.I. a rat. Like I said. Doing fucking... When that shit, when he got caught with all them fucking weapons, like, come on, man, like, the best thing you could do is just stay, stay in the back, you know what I'm saying, just keep moving on some low-key shit like you been doing, like, 
trying to talk and have this type of energy about yourself, you just making yourself look more cornier right, and cornier. Hit the link in the description if you missed. And boost to another motherfucker. You been doing the type of nigga. You just didn't know what to do. You just his best friend, not. You know, let them tell you. They ain't fucking with each other. They have, you know, friendship. They were close, right? But hearing T.I. say what he just said about, you know, being blindsided by Boosie. Not even getting a phone call to let him know, hey, I'm about to go on Vlad to address this viral video of you. Is there anything you want to, you know what I mean, let me know before I go up in and, and speak my thoughts? Nah. According to T.I., Boosie went up there on his own agenda, and here we are. I will say, if this is true, because I did say this in a video yesterday, that we couldn't confirm if Boosie spoke with T.I. prior to coming up on Vlad TV, but according to T.I., he knew nothing about Boosie having issues with this viral video, let alone Boosie going up on Vlad, calling him a rat, and everything else, man. This is crazy. This has been a wild year in 2020. Yeah, I mean, he should have said a call to do it all that, but still. You feel like, like Boosie did T.I. wrong by not giving him the heads up? And you know who he was in That nigga been on crime stop. Let me know <laughs> down below. That's all I got for y'all today. So My name what's, is Rip. What's the Until next time. You know what I mean? But yeah, man, y'all leave a comment, man. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about that. It, it, like I said, all this shit just really be children stuff. <laughs> bit, bit children. You know what I'm saying? Niggas with money, they got, they, they still act like a little child. <laughs> Niggas sound goofy, man. Still want to have a fake persona. I'm a gangster. I go by the real, <laughs> real cold. Like, you know, it's very, it's very sad, man. But yeah, man, y'all let me know, man. Y'all really let me know how y'all really feel about this. Why it's, it's sad, man. It's sad that people really still, you know, coming with this type of energy in this day of time we in now. But like I said, man, y'all <laughs> leave a comment, man. <laughs> I don't even want to get too deep into that. But yeah, man. Y'all already know, man. Y'all hit the subscribe button. Y'all hit that like button, man. We'll be back, man. Shout out to the whole family, man. Oh, oh.